In the data file, we have four variables of interest. First, whether or not the employee has left the workplace, their level of job satisfaction and workload, and whether or not they were a full-time employee. We can see that our outcome variable, whether or not the employee has left, is a nominal or dichotomous variable. If I change to the data view, I can see that the first employee did not leave the workplace, had a job satisfaction level of 3, and a workload level of 6, and was not working full time. To conduct the logistic regression, we go to Analyze, Regression, Binary Logistic. First, we move our dependent variable, whether the employee has left, into the dependent field. Then we move all of our predictors into the covariates field. Now we need to give SPSS a bit of information about our categorical predictors. Now we only have one, whether or not the employee has a full, was full-time or not. We move this variable into the categorical covariates field, and then we tell SPSS that our reference category, or control group, is the first category. Click continue to close this menu. Next, we open up the options menu. We want to select classification plots, the hosmer Leem show goodness of fit test, case-wise listing of residuals, and CI for XB. Click continue to close this menu and then OK to run the logistic regression.